so the Mitchell Dome surrounds me right, right now. Uh, the Milwaukee Chinese Community Center has been at the Mitchell Domes for six years now. Chinese New Year. Well, I wish I knew more about it. I know that I know that there's signs like you're either like a, a rooster or a monkey or a tiger. <laughs> That's about all I know about it. But I guess being here at this uh, this experience, we're going to try to learn a little bit more. And it's, it's actually really cool to get to know a lot about uh, the different cultures. That's really what is so cool. That's actually one of the cool things about Milwaukee. During the Chinese New Year, there are many parties and festivities. And it's a time of good luck and prosperity. The Chinese people believe that during the New Year, a person gains one more year in age, and so also should be wiser because of that. Here they're practicing the ancient art of Taiji Chuan, one of China's major martial arts. Taiji Chuan is an exercise that is a meditation and movement. It's a martial art as well. Uh, it's mostly practiced for the benefit of health, very, performed very slowly, deliberately, uh, and it's all about relaxing. There's an ancient Chinese game called the Chinese Yo-Yo. You can see um, visitors are allowed to practice alongside our staff. The children get these envelopes when they come into the domes. These are red envelopes or hongbao. The color red in China symbolizes luck and prosperity. So during the new year, it's a tradition for the older generation to give these red envelopes to the younger generation. And inside it's mainly money, but there's a secret inside these red envelopes.